Hey, what's up spooky fam? I don't actually know what haul this video would be considered. So we're gonna just call this like a, a, a physical media haul because today uh, is April 20th. It is record store day and uh, I have been going to our local record store, our favorite record store, Dr. Disc. Uh, I've been going to their record store day every year since 2018 and I am so excited about this year's poster um, because it is Snoop and Willie and I had to get one for myself. So today I'm going to do a whole physical media haul. We have DVDs, we have good books, we have CDs, we have VHS tapes. I'm so excited about everything that I have here. Um, majority of it is from Record Store Day, but I did grab a couple of books from uh, Thrift Store and I do want to show them with you or show them to you. So if you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up, subscribe, check out all of my links down below if you'd like to see any more or support the channel any further. And let's get into everything I got at Record Store Day. 2024. Okay, so quickly I'm just gonna show you the books that I got. Uh, we went to Value Village today, the thrift store, and I ended up paying six dollars for this, but I thought it was so cool uh, and I wanted it for myself. Um, it's a collection of Edgar Allan Poe stories and it is small, but it is very well loved and it feels like, I don't know, it didn't need to be sitting on a shelf at a thrift store any longer. It needed to be home with all of my other Edgar Allan Poe works and my little statue of him. <laughs> uh, so I'm just happy to have this. But I also picked this up on a whim because um, the, the it's called The Fog. Uh, it says the yellow slimy cloud of evil and corruption oozed secretly from the depths of the earth to turn human beings into murderous beasts. Uh, a novel by James Herbert. <laughs> that was only two bucks, so I figured I would just grab it anyways. Um, moving on, moving on. All right, we have four DVDs, three CDs, and two tapes. So let's start with the tapes. So for today, all used physical media was 25% off. These tapes were $8 a piece, but I didn't mind. <laughs> this is Night of the Living Dead. Well, and they ended up being 20% off. Uh, Night of the Living Dead. I did not, I have a huge Night of the Living Dead collection, but I did not have it on VHS. I am so, as soon as I saw this, I was like near coming home with me. I also found this copy of Stephen King's Silver Bullet and I'll be honest with you guys, I already have a copy of Silver Bullet but I just finished re finished reading Cycle of the Werewolf and it was so stuck in my forefront that I, I, I don't care. <laughs> um, I just kind of wanted to be greedy and have another one in my collection. Uh, I just feel like, you know, I am the kind of person that wants to collect variant covers. I am one of those nerds. Like, we watch, we love, we digest physical media all the time here in this household. So, um, it is not going to go to waste. But, yeah, I could not pass up. A, a, if they're so different at the same time, I couldn't pass it up. Alright, so those were the... So those were the two tapes that I picked up today. I uh, wish they had more. I really uh, am trying to be selective with the tapes that I buy uh, because for some reason the prices are going up on VHS tapes. Um, so these ones were just really cool to be able to add. All right, very quickly for CDs picked up Cancer Bats, Hail Destroyer. If you guys know, if you're Canadian, if you grew up with Cancer Bats, let me know. <laughs> I also picked up Depeche Mode's Violator, uh, a great album through and through. I just love Depeche Mode. And then we picked up a classic Blink-182's uh, Take Off Your Pants and Jacket. <laughs> Okay, last but not least, the four DVDs that I picked up. I did not have this episode of Masters of Horror, and it is John Carpenter's Cigarette Burns. 
Uh, every time I see an episode of Masters of Horror, I have to add it to my collection. I have so many and one day I just want to sit down and pop them in back to back and just watch a bunch. I feel like it's going to be so cool. Also picked up Graduation Day from 1981 starring Vanna White. This was a really cool find. Grabbed this copy of House by the Cemetery. It was only $2, I believe. We ended up getting it for like a dollar, possibly even. Uh, they might have just thrown it in there at the end. <laughs> and uh, I've mentioned it before, I am a huge Charles Band fan. I full moon entertainment through and through. Uh, Puppet Master completionist. I am trying to complete my Puppet Master collection. So we picked up maybe not the best titled Puppet Master The Littlest Reich. Um, I don't know. This one's just, I have to add it to my, I am, I am a, like a, I am a movie completionist. I have to just finish my collections. I grew up, my uncle who kind of taught me how to search for and organize and collect physical media, who has instilled things in me, has always taught me to, if you're gonna get a, a, a collection of physical media, you have to complete the collection of the series. You, you gotta get it all. If you're gonna get one, you gotta get everything in the series. Anyways, that is all for today's record store day uh, haul. I just love doing this. I love doing hauls. I love searching for physical media. I love collecting, watching, enjoying physical media. Streaming services could just go and we could all just be left with our physical media one day as we saw at the end of leave the world behind so i don't know i just never know <laughs> and that is why i will always collect physical media and on that note um i feel very rambly so i will see you guys very soon Sayonara. oh finally saw late night with the devil amazing loved it finally saw immaculate my rating kind of went down on my initial watch and we are going to see Civil War in IMAX tomorrow, which is very cool. So uh, I'm just excited to wrap up the month of movies with you guys. It's going to be so exciting this month. Okay, uh, see you soon. Sayonara, spooky fam.